Hi everyone. The topic of my final assignment is a popular game TFT, which is an auto chess game. I will introduce the origin of the auto chess first, and then teach you how to play the TFT. I believe that after watching my video, you will learn how to play the TFT and or even other auto chess game to get a good ranking. So, what was the earliest auto chess game? As far as I know, the earliest auto chess game is Dota Auto Chess, and it is also the first game to gain a large number of players. On January 4, 2019, Dota Auto Chess officially landed on Steam, and the game attracted a large number of players for the beginning. The reason is a special gameplay. And there are 8 players in each game, and they are divided into 8 different boards. Each one can buy chess pieces, that is, different cards to form a special combination, and play, and play against other players. In general, it is to get, uh, to get good coins, buy chess pieces, and constantly strengthen your combination to win. As people gradually accept and like auto-chess type games, more and more auto-chess games appear. What I mainly introduced today is my favorite auto chess game, uh, the TFT. The TFT game involves 8 players. Each player can use their own board. Player can place a character on their board which will fight for them. These characters are called units. Games are played in sh short 1 minute rounds. The first half of this round will spend preparing your board for battle, while the second half will be spent watching your unit decide the outcome. You win a round by def defeating all enemies on the board and you lose, lose a round when all units are defeated. So I will use a game I played to explain how to play a TFT well. First, at the beginning, we will choose a character or unit on the public board to help us fight. There will be a piece of equipment on the head of the unit and often the equipment selected at the beginning means the combination you want to play in this round. Because I got a lock at the beginning, so I decided to play Star Guardian in this game. In the first three rounds, I got two Star Locks and uh, got two White Star Rail. Both belong to the Star Guardian, and Lux can deal damage to enemies, and Rail can resist damage in the first row. I choose this way to keep my HP as high as possible in earlier stage. So you will find that I am still at 100 HP after the first 3 rounds fighting with other players. The advantage of getting a high HP volume in the earlier stage is that you can have enough time and HP volume to change the combination or improve the quality of the combination in the later stage. But the, but the disadvantage are also obvious. I will choose equipment last. But the equipment I choose can increase the health of my front row units, which can give my lungs more time to deal damage. Then the next few rounds are the most boring time in this game, uh, because I only need to sell to 50 coins so that I can get maximum interest in each round. In the, in the game of TFT, I think the most important thing is enough money, because only with enough money you can get uh, more opportunities to refresh the store and buy units to improve the quality of the combination. In the process of saving money, I can buy the units I need when the store is refreshed for free every round. This is also very 
very good way to improve my quality of the combination, but it is very dependent on the luck. I will divide the round of TFT into three stages, and now playing the first group of monsters in the end of first stage. I will gradually improve my quality of my combination at this stage, in other words, adjust my combination to make stronger, so I switched the Kaisa to form 4-star Guardians. When I still money to 50 coins, I still have 100 HP, which is a very good signal. Some other players' HP has already decreased to 70 or even 60. Next, I need to use the interest I got in each round to increase my population, because a high population will have more combination choices, and the combination will become stronger at the same time. But I will soon find that my current combination can no longer defeat the enemy, so my HP will decrease very quickly. But because I have high HP in every game, so I don't worry too much about the HP job, which is benefit of maintaining HP in first stage. In the second round of equipment selection, I choose the equipment that suits my combination. The choice, of, the choice of equipment is the second most important thing in this game, I think, because only by choosing the right equipment can the units do the high damage. Here I found that my com combination has been difficult to help me maintain HP, and I have to increase the strength of my combination, so I replaced some units to form stronger regions. After adjusting my combination, I was able to win the next round, but it's very difficult. In the process of each round, I will save money above 40, so that I will not lose a lot of interest. This looks like a small thing, but after a whole game, you will find out this reduces a lot of losses. In this round, I got Nico in the free refresh shop which means I can switch the equipment on Lux to Nico, because Nico is a 4 free card with higher damage. After I have 1 star Nico, I need to increase the population to level 8, because the probability of refreshing a 4 free card at level 8 is much greater than at level 7. Although 1 star Nico is very hard to help me to HP, if I, but if I spent all money at level 7, um, getting a 2-star Nico, it is very likely that I cannot get a 2-star Nico, even spend all the money, because it takes 3 1-star units to get a 2-star unit, so the probability of getting a 3-4 free card at level 8 is very low. After I upgraded to level 8, I spent money to refresh the store at the first time, because I found that my HP was so than 35, this is a very dangerous blood volume. Because in this stage, uh, which is the uh, uh, third stage of the game, and the quality of each player combination is very high, and if you lose a round, you will lose um, lose 15 or more HP. So now every round is very important, and you only have three or even two chances of losing a round. So I will now quickly refresh the store to buy cards as to improve the quality of the combination. Also, my Nico doesn't have two stars, but the quality of other units has been improved by refreshing the store, so I can easily win the round. In the next two rounds, I'm not saving money because my Nico is not two star yet. I, ca I can't guarantee that I can win every next round. Stop, stop refreshing the store and uh, saving money before Nico has two stars is a very bad decision. In this moment, many players will save up to a current amount of money to refresh their store because they want to get more money through interest. My advice is not to do this because many people will lose their game when they don't use all their money because of bad quality of the combination. So I will keep refreshing the store until Nico 2 starts. After my Nico 2 starts, I can easily to win this round.
After two rounds of victories, I lost to this player. Also, my blood volume dropped to 11. But we can find that the blood volume of other players is also very low. So the chances of getting to uh, top 4 are very big. I only ranked 4th in the end, but I can still get points because both the top 4 in TFT can increase points, but the points it by 4th place are not are not as big as the 1st place. My combination in this game is 4 points, not for the 1st rank. So in TFT, some combinations are easy to get points, but it's very difficult to get the 1st place. So why did I choose TFT as my subject? Because my friend says that TFT is very difficult, most of my friends will choose to play traditional League of Legends. They will complain that the gameplay of TFT is very difficult to understand. First of all, there are a lot of equipment in the TFT game, and players need to understand how each equipment is synthesized and what each equipment does. On the basis, players also need to know which equipment is correct for each unit. Many new players will give up TFT because they don't know how to use use of equipment. Second, there are there are a large number of classes in TFT, at least two or even three classes for different units, and a sufficient number of units can form powerful classes. However, due to a large number of units in TFT, it is very difficult to form classes among many units. The third reason is that TFT version update. Every version update means that all classes and units will change, and the player need to forget the content of the previous version. This is a very big challenge for players. So how to play TFT well? In the first stage, player need to determine the combination through the equipment selected at the beginning. Maintain HP will spending as little money as possible. The quantity of units can be improved by getting cards from the free shop each round or by using powerful 3 free units. The second stage on the promise of ensuring blood volume saving money to 50 as soon as possible so that you can get the most interest. Raising population by earning money from each round of interest in the process of increasing the population gradually change the target comb combination. On the third stage, players need to spend all the money to improve the quality of units, at least for all units range 2 stars, because in the third stage every round is very important. There is another situation, when your unit quality is already very high at level uh, 7, then you can continue to increase the population to until level 9. The reason I like TFT is also very simple. It is not only for fun, but also competitive. In a TFT, I can choose different combinations because there are various classes in TFT. The different combination means various in the game, and when I feel boring with one combination, I can try another one. If you play TFT for relax, you can listen to music or watch, watch your favorite movie while playing the game. TFT also has a rank where players can find competition. Players need to think about how to form the strongest competition for its units, and how to maintain HP, and at what stage of game do you need to increase the quality of your units. Okay, Lulu 3. That's a new one. That's actually the first time I've seen Lulu 3, like, in the game I'm in. I don't know if he very gets Fizz see. 3. Okay, Lulu 3 versus Fizz 3. This is where it gets weird. Ooh. Things are about to get really weird here. What a mech, though. Lulu with the full team polymorph? Holy. <laughs> oh my. How long does it last? It lasts for 8 seconds. <laughs> There's still muffins. <laughs> There's still oh back to bang muffins. <laughs> Oh my god. Here is a really cool video I find if you really try to a round of TFT. The main reason 
of my video is to introduce the game and、uh, its gameplay to players who have not played TFT before. It is more like a teaching video, give some suggestions to players who have not learned about auto chase game. So there is my video. So thanks for watching.